Hi guys, it's Manek from EarlyLearningMom.com. I'm here. We're at the chiropractors. You can see it over there. We have a couple minutes before our appointment. Um, we were supposed to come on Thursday, but Z is having a Nate appointment today, and it's at 6.30, so I thought if we could get seen by the chiropractor, I wouldn't have to go outside tomorrow night. But then I remembered I still have to go outside. I will have to take Wesley to range, or yeah, range for cadets. But that's neither here nor there. I don't have to, I can send him out to warm up the vehicle and bring him and drive home. Anyhow, we, so we're getting our regular adjustment here. He has been doing amazing. Um, no more ear pains, the ear infection seems to be gone. Um, he's doing exceptionally well, if not better than before. And, and now we are trying something different. We, we, done Nate before in the past and Nate is a um, kind of like a natural allergy um, therapy and it uses acupressure points and um, kind of little vials that have like kind of the essence or like the um, like a microscopic amount of the allergen or the problem for the body and um, basically we muscle test for it and we do acupressure. It stays touching the body for about 20 minutes and then we take it off and we avoid that item for as long as we can. However, Nate has been um, known to be helpful for people with Lyme disease. Now, Z doesn't have a Lyme disease diagnosis, but that being said, he has a lot of symptoms and he has been bit by a tick, uh, a few ticks in the last couple of years and he is kind of um you know we live in tick see like in the woods like we're hiking in the summer and um you know sometimes Lyme disease doesn't show up with the typical bullseye mark so I was going to have some testing done now to have him tested in, at our doctor's office, the tests that are used in Manitoba are very unreliable and they are very prone to false um, negatives. And I don't want to put them through blood tests for nothing. And so I looked into, I contacted my naturopath and I looked into paying for testing out of a really respectable lab in Germany. And the cost like the bare minimum testing would be like over 400 euros and the like total testing, which is probably what we would want Max is Living, well, Max yep, Living. we're gonna go to Max Living in two minutes, okay? And so it was gonna cost us over 700 euros. When we exchange that, it's almost $1,100 Canadian. So I decided that we're going to take a natural approach first because we're going to be starting him back on biocidin and biocidin um, supplements apparently sometimes can clear um, Lyme disease or help with it. So we're hoping that if we do that along with Nate, um, if he does have Lyme disease, it'll take care of it. Um, so we'll muscle test for it today. So anyhow, somebody is anxious. He wants to go get into the chiropractor's office. So we're gonna go get an adjustment and drive to our Nate appointment. And when we get back in the van from Nate, I'll let you know what happened. So anyhow, stay Somebody down. is waiting for his adjustment. Right. Do you have a wiggly tooth? Can you show me your wiggly tooth? Itchy. Itchy, can you show it to me? Where's your wiggly tooth? It's right there, huh? You gonna get it out? Oh, and while I'm waiting at this train, I thought I would come and tell you, in case you were curious, the tooth that Z was wiggling at the chiropractor, he lost it at the Nate practitioner. This is his third tooth he's lost. It's the first one that I actually ha I was able to get. It's like itty bitty, itty bitty incisor. So anyhow, Yes, I'll put the music back on. Anyhow, back to what I was saying a minute ago. Okay guys, so we just came out of Nate. Um, well, we went to the chiropractor, he had an adjustment, and then we went to Nate, and she tested him for Lyme, which came back, um, like he tested muscle, po tested positive. But basically what that could mean, it doesn't necessarily mean he has Lyme, but it means the body is more susceptible to Lyme. It could mean he has it as well. It's, um, it's just that his body's susceptible to it. So there was um, 
she has other patients that are that she's treating for Lyme and there is a Nate kind of special like the Nate practitioner that specializes in Lyme in Calgary and the um, she has some patients that um, have Drop done consoles fries. you dropped your fries here I got sorry he was looking for his supper so um, basically they see this kind of uh, they don't see the specialist but they do like phone consults and she gives like her recommendations and then Aileen our Nate lady does his Nate and, or does their Nate so there was a few things that she's learned that are really good for people with Lyme and there was a new like brain uh, mix which um, it helps support the brain is my understanding and anyhow he went in there and he was super calm relaxed and then we started treating him and then he kind of went wild and that tends to happen when we're treating something that is um, he's really susceptible to so or that he's really reacting to like a strong reaction um, like sugar was our worst he had like an absolute meltdown and then for the next 24 hours he was losing his bananas and so I figured that was a good one to hit and he um, so next time we'll come back next week and we will um, treat him for Lyme and then we're going to kind of look at some of the other things that have been recommended to other people and kind of see like we have treated a lot like we've done a lot of Nate in the past years like he's been seeing his Nate practitioner since he was two and I mean it has helped a lot but now we have like we had stopped going um, just because I was running out of ideas of things to treat and like we had done the whole autism kit we had done a bunch of things so now that we have like a new direction to go with this um, we're gonna start seeing her and we have some insurance coverage so uh, it's almost the end of the year, so we may as well use it up. So, anyhow, I'm going to end this vlog here. We're going to head home. It was just a quick kind of like therapy evening, basically, and kind of what's going on with Z. And uh, I hate this lighting. Um, a new, just kind of approached. Does that fix it? Nope. There it is. Um, just kind of a different approach to therapy like we we do the doman method but um this is the chiropractor and the neat are complimentary you want something to drink okay yeah. mommy's just gonna close out the blog do you want to say good night peeps Hi. say good night yeah. you blow kisses <laughs> anyhow so just uh, sharing our experience with alternative therapy that has been super helpful in the past so Anyhow, thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe, like. I'm working towards getting a thousand subscribers and I'm well on my way. So if you could help me out, that would be fantastic. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.